Hi, it's Gabriella from Radiant on Raw. I saw a Facebook page the other day where one of my friends asked for advice on how to quickly get rid of a cold she was suffering from. And while I was thinking about all the different tips I could give her, and um, other people were already posting those tips like, you know, add echinacea, um, take more vitamin C, up your beta-glucan supplements, um, essential oils, you name it, it suddenly occurred to me that I was actually suffering from a cold myself at the time and I still am. I don't get colds very often because one of the things I do is I make sure that my immune system is really, really strong. So even when I do get a cold, it doesn't usually knock me completely sideways, but it's still a nuisance. So I asked myself, well, what am I doing right now? And actually, apart from keeping up my good immune system by doing the things I do anyway, through nutrition and supplementation, I don't really do that much. I'm just letting myself have a cold. Because think about it, that cold is a sign of your body that it needs a bit of attention. Perhaps it's overtired. Perhaps you've done too much and it made you susceptible to get this cold. When we have a runny nose and we cough up phlegm, it's all a way of getting rid of toxins in our body. It's actually a cleansing mechanism. And what we tend to do is we fight it. We don't want it. We want to get rid of it. So we bombard it. And some people do it with um, you know, flu, rem flu and cold remedies and other people do it in natural ways. But the tendency is still trying to get rid of it. Now I say, try not to get rid of it. Have it, let it do its thing. And when you let it do its thing, and you don't push your body to get through it faster than nature wants you to get through it, the likelihood is that you come out stronger, fitter, healthier, and you'll feel better, you will have a stronger immune system for the future because your body was allowed to do what it's good at, which is defend itself and you're not getting in, in the way. So the best you can do is drink plenty of fluids, drink green juices and smoothies if you do those or you know have access to them. Eat light foods, mostly plant-based, you know, not kind of heavy creamy things that might uh, perhaps in, in, increase your amount of mucus, etc. But just stay to light foods, steamed vegetables, raw vegetables, fruit, and rest. Rest and rest again. And then when you feel up to it, and it's a lovely day, and it's not too windy out there, and it's not raining, then go for a little walk and it will be much less severe. So stick with me, watch my next few videos because I'll talk some more about the immune system and what you can do to really boost your immune system so that you're not so susceptible to those colds that everybody suffers from at the moment. See you in my next video. Thanks and goodbye.